What's up guys, welcome back to Drew Tutorial and if you're new, special welcome to you. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the sleep mood issues that you're facing on your Windows 10 or even on your Windows 11 computer. For the purpose of this tutorial, I'm using a Windows 11, but the steps for the Windows 10, it's basically the same thing. So you can follow the same thing and you'll be able to fix the issues on your Windows 10 PC as well. Before we jump in guys, would you mind taking a moment to give this video a like? and hit that subscribe button because this will let me know that you found value within this video. And on top of that, the biggest benefit is that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Now let's continue. So click Windows key on your keyboard or on your taskbar and you simply want to type in control panel and you will find a control panel there. Go ahead and open up that. And from here, what you want to do in case you don't have this view and you have something like a small view or whatever the view you're having categories views, you want to go ahead and click on the category and click on large or small icons. For me, it's better to use the large icon so that I can easily see what I'm looking for, right? Now click on power options from here and from here you want to go ahead and click and change plan settings. Right from here, click and change advanced power settings and from the left hand side, you want to go ahead and expand sleep and where you have the sleep, you want to go ahead and click on these or different options and basically put them on never, both on battery and on PC as well. You can see, for example, under the wake timer, you can basically put on battery never or, dis or disable and you can put it for the plugged in, you can disable or you can even enable it. But the most important one is the sleep after, right? So you want to expand that and basically put both of them on never, right? So next thing is the PCI Express, guys. You want to go ahead and expand the PCI Express and where you have the link state power option, you want to go ahead and expand that. And for the on battery, you see where you have maximum power saving. Also the plugged in, you can easily click on each of these and simple turn them off, right? So you want to go ahead, if you're using it on battery or, or plugged in, you can set these to never as well. Then simply go ahead and click and apply, then click and okay. Now for the final step, guys, all you have to do for the final step is go ahead and open up your CMD. So Windows key there, type in CMD, and you will have the command prompt to run this as administrator here. Go ahead and choose yes once you have the prompt or pop up and all you have to do is simple type in this command here you'll find it in the description of this video as well it's powercfg.exe space forward slash there and you want to type in hibernate and you want to type in hibernate space off and go ahead and hit enter as well and that's all there is to it guys now once this is done go ahead and restart your computer right restart your computer and this should fix the issue for you. Here you have it, guys. I really hope you found value within this video. And if you do, don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.